No New York resident will be surprised to learn that the subway is crawling with microorganisms. But did you also know that when you ride the subway, you're also riding with anthrax and the bubonic plague? Researchers at Weill Cornell Medical College went to every subway station in New York City, taking over a year to collect samples from floors, benches, and poles, turnstiles. Humans were just one of the over 15,000 life forms the researchers uncovered in New York City's subways, including rodents, insects, and of course, bacteria. Almost half of the samples they collected match no known organism, which just goes to show how much more basic science we have to do just to get those samples into the database. Going around the subway for over a year collecting samples might seem frivolous, but the research can be used to protect New York City from bioterrorism and also can be used by city planners to track disease outbreaks. A for basic science. If you're a New York City resident, don't worry. Even with all that bacteria, for most healthy humans, the subway is still completely safe. In fact, you could lick a subway surface if you really wanted to. Stand clear of the closing doors, please. Hi everyone, I'm Jade Lovell, resident science nerd on the Young Turks Network. You're watching SciQ and we know you don't want to miss an episode, so please click the subscribe button down below.